Hi YouTube! So here is a no waste minimalist suggestion here. Um, so we are no longer buying Q-tips and we are no longer buying cotton balls. And this is what we used to keep them in. So obviously we have like a little bit left. Uh, the last time I bought Q-tips was over a year ago. Um, and then we just slowly kind of are weaning ourselves off of those and then cotton balls my goodness I don't even know when the last time I bought these these I wow they maybe a year and a half ago maybe um, and this is how many we have left <laughs> so quite a bit left so I don't know I may just give them away to somebody um, but the reason why we don't buy them anymore is because man I used q-tips for so many things um, cleaning out my ears um, cleaning just so many so many things and then the cotton balls I really only used them for my face taking off my makeup and um, taking off my nail polish well I don't wear nail polish anymore and if I did because I do still have a little bit left um, I might just use something maybe like an old shirt to, to take off the polish maybe um, but I'm really just trying to be very natural and very clean and uh, nail polish is not <laughs> so here are the containers that we used to have them in um, I think what I'm gonna do with these when they everything's empty is probably just give them away um, I just feel like they kind of need to be refurbished and I like everything super neat and clean and these little like right here I've had these for like 15 years <laughs> right here is kind of getting a little bit weird looking I've tried to clean it off and it really just needs to be um, fixed up and replaced so um, I really like them but obviously I don't I'm not gonna have a need for them anymore so I'm just gonna give them away so here's what I replaced all this stuff with q-tips I don't clean with them anymore I don't even need to clean with them there I the ways I clean now I don't even need q-tips so that's amazing as far as my makeup goes I just use these now it's just a cotton flannel um, you know super thin and I just hemmed the the edges here and it I like it better than a cotton ball actually because it doesn't hurt my skin as much and I just wash these so they're reusable um, and then I guess you could make a bunch of these too if you have if you take off your own nail polish and then clean them I would just make sure that you only use those certain things for your nails and nothing else so really make sure that you keep that separate I'm not really sure how you clean that but I'm sure there's ways out there check on YouTube and then I just keep them in this container here it's a actually it's a Harry and David box and I set it on the back of my toilet oh let me see if you can see that yeah see my grandma got me a bunch of Harry and David chocolates one year but I kind of like that dual kind of look and so I just kept it like that um, I don't know, I may even like paint the insides or something. Sometimes I just throw these in here, sometimes I lay them like really nice looking like this, but I do use them every day and I use about three of these a day, one for each eye and then one for all over my face. So they get used a lot, but anyway, those are just some tips and tricks uh, th about things that we do um, to take away the cotton balls and to take away the... the um, Q-tips here. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned the reason why we don't use Q-tips on our ears anymore is because it's actually really not very good for your ears. It, um, because of how the cotton balls are, or the Q-tips are, they can go pretty far into your ear and it just, you're just shoving in the, um, the earwax. So even though it feels really nice, if I just clean up my ear while I'm in the shower with my washcloth, it works just as well. So... And better because I'm not shoving the wax into my ear <laughs> so um, yeah so I don't know I'm really excited there's two more products that won't be purchasing anymore and I was actually gonna purchase some more of these I don't know maybe like two years ago just because these are just kind of getting you know just worn and you can kind of see they need to be redone and I tried to redo them and wasn't really successful and so I was just gonna get some new ones and now this is something that I don't have to purchase again so, yay! <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching.